The method from our first quick tip works great if you track position scale and rotation. But if you also track shear and perspective, the following method is more accurate. <laughs> Duplicate the layer that you want to mask and draw a rough mask around the region that you want to track. Set its mask mode to none and track it with the mask tracker and perspective mode. <laughs> Load the mask in Mask Tracker Plus and create a stabilized precomp with skew and perspective. Choose the stabilized precomp region so that it covers a bit more than the area you want to rotoscope. <laughs> now open the stabilized precomp, create your roto on a solid, and set your footage as a guided layer. Since the tracked area in the precomp is not moving a lot, a few keyframes should do the job. In the main composition, you can now use the stabilized precomp as an alpha mat. Mm.